You found the record. So we go here and take a ride. We kill the enemies or not. Go back here. Up. Kill the spider lady. And here is a room. That's the chest. And this is the record. Do you remember the moment you fell in love? The moment when when you were the only two people in the world? That splendid magical moment when all your sadness was forget for Gotten. Okay, I was, I was trying to say forgiven, but it was not the word. A heavenly voice representing craft, a, a gift from the red actress Adelina Corday to you, fascination. Oh my God, that English was so much a messed up, boy. Yeah. Now, to get my goddamn ergo. Where it is, I have no idea. <laughs> I think we should just drop down. I mean, here. That's what I wanted to say. <laughs> I do not know. I want to say up here. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, nice. Good and bye. Oh, bro. <laughs> I cried a little. <laughs> okay, now we get the weapon. First and foremost. Ooh! Okay. The King of Popezzo. She got the disease. Oh, it's you. Come closer, won't you? When you reach a certain age, it's a comfort to reflect on old memories. That's a portrait of me when I was young. <laughs> I was so feisty, so fearless back then. I loved the world. The world loved me back. The passion of those days is long gone, but I still dream of those memories. I'm curious what your young eyes see. Is there any resemblance between me and that portrait? Yeah, boy! I knew you were that girl. Ugh. Weird. Even taught you good manners. Yes, those beautiful memories are still vivid in my mind. Time. Time and the memories that fill it are all we have. I hope you're making some good memories of your own. It may be a comfort to you someday. Have no thanks for keep also I found out something a costume Ooh, I don't know which one I think this one's the one 
And then you come here. Show off clothes. Move to equipment. Bro. Oh my god. Do it. Let's use it. You use the show of clothes here. But I don't remember which costume. The one she gave, gave it to you. Maybe don't have this. Maybe this one. Which one was it? God damn it. Oh my god, I'm getting lost. Survivor and those are not the ones. This is the first. Yeah, this is the schoolboy. People have no thanks for keeping. People. People. Anyway, I don't care. I don't know. I have no idea. You give me a weapon, boy. A weapon calls for a great warrior. What? Oh, oh boy. Puppet Reaper. Boy! Love it. Yes. Oh, I had both. Bro, no. I... I was moving slowly, I presume. Oh, and you... This is just a boss weapon. All right, let's see what you got. I also have to talk to Geppetto and all that uh, BS. But first, the weapon is a uh, life. Ah, uh, it is a little slow. Holy shit! Bro! My god! <gasps> I'm crying. I'm actually crying. Hello! What the fuck? Boy, this is a goddamn awesome weapon. <gasps> oh my god. Holy shit. It's also a technique boy. Yeah, we're we're trying it but not right now. Oh There's something I want to tell you, Geppetto's puppet. Please come to the hotel garden on the way to Elysian Boulevard. Okay. Aha, uh -huh, you're here. Took me a while to see it. Welcome, good sir. At last, we speak frankly instead of with professional reserve. I have something to confess. 
Something involving your unique perspective. I am a puppet whose ego has awoken. I don't know exactly why, and we need not dwell on the details. Instead, I wish to dwell on the welfare of Lady Antonia. I adore Lady Antonia. It is a presumptuous feeling for a puppet to have, to be sure. I have no intention of putting myself forward, of course. However, I cannot watch her die. It's too painful. Thus, I need your unique perspective. You exist somewhere between human and puppet. Can a puppet and a human fall in love? Have you ever met a puppet who loves a human? It exists indeed. An unbelievable love to be sure. Nice. The wedding ring has its symbol. I fear even trying to pursue such a splendid happiness. I have no intention of telling her, of course. It wouldn't be proper to burden someone so frail. If I may be frank, this is better than I dared hope. Even if you are telling me a sweet lie, I shall savor it. Thank you. It was wise to confide in you. Thank you for granting me that wisdom. Ooh, nice. Now, do we have any ergo left? Ooh, we got. Antonia's condition is getting worse. I knew it would come to this. The petrification disease locks people inside a cage inside their own bodies we're all safe thanks to her sacrifice but i wish for a miracle to save everyone me as well i'll use my power uh, use your power use all the power boy holy shit only two levels my man Capacity, eh, it's on the edge. It's on the edge. But no man. Oh, look! Now I can run. What the hell was that? In other episodes. Whoa. Boy, where are you? Oh, something here. LOL I only have a crank Ooh, motivity technique and advance and of balance Why do you have to get off the goddamn chair? Just go back one menu, please. We got no quartz. I got no main, no reserve. You won't get that reference because it's... It's unimportant. It's from Crisis 1. Where the hell is my boy? Yo! Gerperto, please. Where are you?
Is that door open? It's new or no? This is the door. To Rosa Zibaboza Bira Bebo, yes. Interesting. And where is he? Maybe this dude. Ah, I heard you defeated the king of mm -hmm. puppets. Amazing. Ah, the puppets appear lost without their leader. They have no purpose, no focus. To think one can have so much control through ergo waves. If we don't determine who or what is causing it, this could all happen again tomorrow. I fear I must call upon you again, my friend. Please gather records of the puppets' ergo waves while you're defeating them. How? How do I do I that? Welcome, friend. Polentina Pulcinella Pulcinella Oh my god, I have none for nothing Okay, a boy I don't know where my dude went Nah, I, I have no idea. All right. Let us commence. Command Sava, Sapel Tralala. Okay. I'm glad you're safe. I was so scared I would lose my precious son. It's risky for me just being out here. Fortunately, you didn't need my help. I'm so proud that I got to see my son defeat the king. Hopefully the lesser puppets will die down soon. Now that the king is dead, the puppets have no leader, no direction. But the curse of the petrification disease still lingers. It's tough, but I know where you should go now. The Grand mm. Exhibition. Rumors say the alchemists there have developed a cure. As a man of invention, I'm skeptical of the alchemists, both their science and their motives. But they may be the city's last hope. Won't you help me, son? Take this. You'll find it most useful. If it will help Antonia and the others, it's worth exploring. Go to the Grand Exhibition and see what you can find. Two, eight, nice. Oh, ye. Oh, ye. Ah, uh, that. This box didn't have a texture on this side. Anyway, anything you have to add? That one puppet could control so many others. That's a memorable feat indeed. 
Unlike a real king, the puppet left no heir. Mm -hmm. The remaining puppets are leaderless, and we can reclaim the city. But it's still a city beset by the petrification disease. Seek a cure from the alchemists at the Grand Exhibition. The one, unlike a real... But it's still a city... Thank you. How the hell are we still fighting puppets? They are not... They're not attacking anymore. No, they very much do. They very much do attack. She attacked all my health away. Doo -doo -doo. What's going on? All these puppets look utterly down, depressed even. And that seems weird. Hmm. That's weird, right? Ah, oh, okay. At least it's not a big ass enemy. <gasps> no, 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 we need that. Crescent Moonstone. We'll go up, but, for, but first let's see what's down here. I think this is a a stop edge, a dead end. That's the word. What the fuck, stoppage? Who the hell says stoppage? What? Oh, it's not a dead end at all. But anyway, let's see what's up those uh, stairs. Oh, god damn it. There was nothing. Can we jump? Nope. You thought you'd ambush my ass. We can go up uh, or we can come here. Oh, this is another bullshit. Oh, 
nice. I didn't think that that uh, move would do something. Peek? No, let's not peek in there. Clock, sword, and the handle. Ooh, we have it. C and C, yeah. I believe there's a boss. I mean, a big enemy. No? Maybe. Lorenzini Arcade. What the hell is this dog? Okay, it's not opening from this abada. I mean, yeah. Let's go up there and see what's there. I don't think there's anything. Yeah. Huh. Lorenzini Arcade Even gonna, or maybe. Nah. Cafe, restaurant, and wines. No. 
All right, we reached the thingy. Where are we exactly? Lorenzini Arcade. Oh, it's another. Uh, okay, Lorenzini Arcade. <gasps> We can talk to that girl. All right. We reached a new area, which looks amazing. We beat the puppet master. And now we will uh, search for a petrification disease. Cure. Thank you guys for watching and I will catch you in the next one. Bye bye.